Carpe Canis and Carpe Daisypus. When hog and varmint hunting up in North Texas, I arrived on property, got up my Pulsar Apex Laser Range Finding XQ38 that I have mounted on my 6.5 Grindel rifle and did some scanning of the property. Here I'm looking at various landmarks and I'm in scan mode and if you look at the top right hand side of the screen, you'll see where I'm getting yardage estimates. It updates every couple seconds or so and, and sends out a laser beam, takes a measurement and tells me what the distance is. So change batteries, notice this deer come out, thought I'd practice on a living animal. And it looks like 234 yards is the distance behind the deer into the brush and the deer is about 210 yards or so. Well despite having a collar out I didn't have any action there so I moved to a different side of the property to the Sendero, set up the collar, ran it for a while, got absolutely nothing out of this area. Decided to pack up, head to the truck and move on to a different property. On the way back to the truck I spied two coyotes out in this field and here I'm moving parallel with the wind trying to get into position to get a good view of the coyotes and at this point I can only see the one coyote. I'm not on level footing right here. The coyote seems to lay down so I go ahead and try to move my position slightly to get it on a little bit more level ground and get set up before trying to take a shot. So I take a couple steps here, find level ground. The coyote pops his head back up. I take the safety off. And that coyote goes down. Then up in the upper right hand corner I see a coyote run off in the distance and I figure my hunt is over at 10.48 p.m. Turn off the recorder, I hear an armadillo, turn the recorder back on, catch the armadillo running away, get it in my sights, get it shot, turn off the recorder, start to move. When I spy a coyote again, turn on the recorder, and by that time, uh, I already had the coyote shot and it's down. So this is the first coyote. It was feeding on the remains of a dead 210 pound sow that I'd killed two days earlier. And this is the second coyote. Both of them were males. In the excitement of killing the second coyote, I completely forgot about the armadillo. So here it is in slow motion. Carpet Canis, my friends.